there are heroes in our culture and they're on their own journey. And they do bring back things that are valuable to the culture as a whole, but the culture as a whole uh, is, is ignoring them. <laughs> Everybody knows that the water's rising, and everybody knows the cookies are burning. When we get into situations like the one we're in today, people have a tendency to look back to, to a time that they imagined when things were better, and I think that's why there is this, this turning toward the past. The Christian right, they look back to leave it to Beaver, and they think that the world was a simpler and safer and more ethical place. This looking for family values is in its own way an archaic revival, except it doesn't go back far enough. I mean, they're not even scratching the surface. Well, perhaps uh, they're afraid to go back any further. my village, my elders referred to the modern world as a fire culture. This culture really has a big problem with ancestors. When it thinks back to its past, it feels so uncomfortable that it's preferred to look into the future. Fire ritual are ritual associated with ancestors. And so if there is any ritual reconciliation that needs to happen, it needs to be fire ritual. Nothing more primal than arranging a circle around fire. Whether that's genetic or, or whether that's simply it proceeds from the fact that uh, we all have some kind of essential history in the beginning, um, I don't know. All I do know is that if you strike that chord, they'll come running. There's no question of that.
Burning Man is not new. Cultures have been, have been gathering like this and have burning some kind of effigy for a very long time. Um, I think it was just our time to do it. There, there, there are a whole host of stories. I was burning, uh, my heart was broken. I was burning a, a tribute to my old love. I was burning my effigy of my girlfriend. I was burning an effigy of my girlfriend's boyfriend. I was burning an effigy of my ex-girlfriend's lawyer. I was burning, a, it just goes on and on. And, and people like stories. I don't blame them for that. Um, but, uh, 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 but, uh, but they missed the point. When we decided uh, to go down and burn a man in 1986 on Baker Beach in San Francisco, once we lit the figure, everybody from north to south on the beach came running. What we created is a spontaneous community. When we compared notes a couple of months later, it, it became clear to us that we both sort of just intuitively, instantly decided at that moment that we'd do it again. 